California is live downtown at the Wells. So Brandon, how are the Gamecock fans handling this loss? Well, a lot of them went in with a lot of confidence, obviously. You hear second seed against the 10th ten, ten, ten seed. Excuse me. Uh, you think that's going to be a pretty easy game. Uh, absolutely the complete opposite. It was a very hard-fought game. Uh, Arkansas just simply uh, out-hustled the Gamecocks tonight. You know, fans did pile in to uh, the well tonight. And again, they went in with a lot of confidence. That A lot of them walked out with their heads down low and shaking their head. The Gamecocks had their work cut out most of the night against the Razorbacks. Arkansas simply just outscored the second seed of Gamecocks all night long, a game which many Gamecock fans traveled from all over just to be here in Greenville. In the end, South Carolina again fell to Arkansas 95-89. to But Gamecock fans say, keep your chin up. Some even saying at least the tournament was nearby this year. It's better to have seen them play than not seen them at all. Well, it's always good to come close. You know, it seems like, especially for the NCAA, we always get in a different region that we really can't travel. But anytime we close to home, it's great to travel. Hey, we, we still got the big dance to go to, and we're a pretty good for basketball team. We played really hard tonight. Shots just didn't fall. Uh, again, there's plenty of basketball still to be played here at the well tomorrow and uh, for the first time in five years, it will not be the Gamecocks who take home the SEC trophy here. Now, the NCAA Women's Basketball Tournament will tip off later this month. Again, the season is not over, but this uh, could hurt the women's uh, seating, so we'll stay on top of that when that all goes down. But for now, live here at the well in downtown Greenville, Brand Livornia, Fox Carolina, the 10 o'clock news.